we are. Nam hey. 2017. Mm. We're on the sexual stand that is PRS. Yep. And we are standing now approximately two feet away from a sexual guitar. I can smell it. Yeah. It just smells of oozing this sex. Isn't, this isn't just any PRS Super Eagle. This isn't even a Marks and Spencer's PRS Super Eagle. <laughs> this is John Mayer's actual personal Super Eagle. Which means if I touch here, some of John Mayer's sexual DNA <laughs> has transferred into my fingers. I can physically feel I'm a better guitar player. The tingling. Uh, I feel it in my plums. Seriously, there are seven guitars here that belong to artists, so it's yep. kind of cool. Um, there's like a S2 single cut over there, belongs to Jack Fowler. Nice he was in the East Enders, I think, wasn't he? Yeah. Or was that after Fowler? <laughs> that looks really cool, actually. We talked um, about that. It's relic discovered, yeah. but it's not relic, but it's played. We asked all of you know. I've been asking Paul to do a relic yes. yeah. guitar for ages, but he says no. Um, John McLaughlin, crazy killer jazz player. Beautiful. Neil Sean, everybody knows oh. who Neil Sean is. Is it more than a feeling? Uh, yeah. Was that Journey? Yeah. I think it was. And of course... Uh, totally gay for mayor, as you know. Yeah. Carlos Santana's one of his PRSs. Another Tremonti. Mark Tremonti. Yeah. Of and one of our very, very, very good friends there at the end. Oh, yeah. A Mark lovely Holden. bloke. Yeah. A lovely bloke. So, yeah. anyway, should we go and see what else is new uh, on the uh, PRS Before stand? we do that, before we do that, we have to look down here. Oh, yes. This is very, very, very special and very, very new. This is um, the new JMOD 100 head, one channel, with yeah. a, uh, a gain state uh, overdrive in it and a matching cap. We haven't had a chance to hear this yet. We've just seen the video that John Mayer did. But um, if it's anything like the uh, Two Rock John Mayer signature that he did a few years ago, this will be one of the most epic sounding kind of single channel amplifiers yep. ever. Looks good. Uh, and one of my Facebook friends uh, is going to lend us his Two Rock John Mayer. <laughs> uh, and we're going to get one of these and an original Two Rock John Mayer, put them up side by side in our video room. Pete's going to play every John Mayer lick that he knows. <laughs> Um, I don't know, maybe, maybe John, if you're watching, maybe you'd like to come and do the Yes, please. Like come in. Meet the captain. Um, it would be the most, it would be, be like a life highlight for me. Um, That's it. You can shut the doors after that, couldn't you? Yeah. That's it. That's it. Hang on. I'm, I'm retired now. That's Thanks. it. I'm done. So, yeah, look at this. Uh, single channel, um, but with a kind of a gain switch, I think. Effects loop. And, you don't, and if you need to ask how much it is, then you already can't afford it. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. There's nothing new around here. Uh, the, the, the new stuff I still think for NAM is um, the Single Cut 594 is still their kind of new release. Uh, but here's just some more models that are in the range. That's, that Santana retro is beautiful. Let's just, just do some nice close up sweeps, yeah. Taylor, of just pretty guitars. This is pretty cool here. It's going to make this little body. Look at that. It's going to make this little two minute guitar porn segment whilst I Alex maybe Lifeson sing to you. Um, mm, oh, check man. It. Mm -hmm. Check it. Mm. It's a beautiful day to look at guitars. I'd rather be. No, I would, eh? This is the only place I want to be. Mm. Check it. Out. Sexy. <laughs> um, that McCarthy. There is. is uh, do you want to see some crazy, crazy flame top wood library limited edition mad guitars? Look. Oh, that's the. Um, is that the Mark Holcomb eight string? What? There's an eight string? Not What's oh, there is custom 24 eight string. I think this is custom shop stuff where, you know, that if you've got an stunning. idea and you've got the dough to back it up. Look at that, uh, look at that fingerboard. You can have what you like. Well, yeah, it's like blue flame, isn't it? Absolutely stunning. Let's keep going round. I like this hollow body uh, satin finish. What is this? It looks beautiful. Wow. What's that, like a burled mahogany, is it? Maybe some bubinga or mahogany. Bubinga. It's a great name. <laughs> I hope they don't ban that wood. I'd be a, such a shame if I could never say Babinga You ever can say again. Babinga as much as you like. Um, <laughs> look out. Custom 24 semi hollow. I've, I like got, one, all the I've got one of those right <laughs> yeah, now, you, I'll tell you. A semi yeah. or a hollow. Pomegranate um, smoke burst. Pomegranate smoke burst. Yeah. That's pretty as well. That's an Big jazz smoke. guitar around here. Single cut arch top. Oh, that's interesting. It looks like a kind of a shrunk sort of 175 or something, doesn't it? Like, I don't know, actually. Yeah, it's got a, got a softer, ones, softer sort of oh, cutaway, hasn't it? A softer horn. Beautiful inlay. This is interesting. Bars. It's got a really interesting kind of white back on a green flame guitar. 
I, I, hope, I hope you're enjoying this commentary. Does this make for an interesting video? Yeah, I don't know. Comment in the section below, and we'll read them after we've finished. How do you pronounce this? So we won't this be able to do anything name? about it. Malachite. Malachite. Or, or in some places, Malachite. <laughs> Malachite. I think it's Malachite. Yeah. Uh, it's a precious stone, or I think, a Mal Malachite. Yeah. Okay. Probably green. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. That's pretty, isn't it? So now, now Lee, you are, you're looking uh, to, to acquire a 594. I'm, I'm on a 594 right? single cut in yeah. McCarty Sunburst or something old and vintage looking. Mm. In an ideal world, relict, but Paul won't do that for me. So I'm going to have to relic it myself. <laughs> I'll help you with that. Um, <laughs> I think we should okay, try and way. find Paul and interview him. We'll, uh, we'll take I'm, out I'm, the words. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to absolutely take over this interview. Good. 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 We have a guitar for you. Bring it in. You filming? Are you filming? That's good. Right. Right. Is this did my letter to Father Christmas? This is your letter to Father Christmas. Are oh, you kidding me? No, man. no, 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 no. Oh, just open the case. Where you go? Oh <laughs> my God. <laughs> that is. That's the color. That's the model. I'm welling up, man. Cool. <laughs> so here's what you don't know. I'm giving it to him. <laughs> so you have to send it back to the to, to us, and we're gonna do all the artist tweaks on it, and we're gonna give it to you. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. I got you. After all your videos, I got you finally. That's mad. So this is what happened. He he got his hands on one of these and loved the sound. He says, can I get one in the color that I want, right? Yeah. And we happened to have one and we pulled it out and this is your guitar, this is our gift to you. I want to sign it, I want to sign it as a gift from us on the back of the whole bit. <laughs> so here. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I'm sorry, I dropped it. Oh. I don't, I don't know what to say. <laughs> you say, say, be glad I didn't drop the guitar. Oh, man. So, listen, do you know the guitars are worth less when you take this off? Did you no. know that? People like get mad when uh, you take the thing off here. I got, I mean. Let me have the mic, you can hold it. It's just, for the first time I picked one of these up, you know when you said Bernie had two, didn't he? Yeah. And it was, a, it was a tipping, it was a pivotal moment for me. It was kind of like the, the, the 594 double cut, you know, I was nearly ready. And then the single cut was just like, I'd need to do this, man. This so, is just... So Neil Sean just got one of these, and he went crazy over it. He just loves the way it sounds. It's really, I mean, it's its not just the sound. It's its, it's all of it. It's, it is literally everything. The, 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 the detail about, you know, the positioning of all the hardware, the sound, the way the tone changes as you mess with the volume controls and the tone controls. Actually, you know, Neil mentioned that. He it's mentioned it, he mentioned that the, the way the tone control one pickup tone control fi affects the other pickup when they're when both pickups are on in the middle position. It's 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 the ultimate, you know, it's the ultimate guitar for me at least in, in the in the PRS. Well, range this one's your personal guitar. So listen, yes, you can't insane. sell this thing. You sell everything. No. You have to keep this. I one. will. You have to keep this one. I really don't one. have, like, how many guitars do you personally own? Not a lot, right? Five or, five or six, yeah, maybe. Yeah, yeah you got more big than me. I got two. Yeah. yeah. But, oh, man. And you're sitting right near the John Mayer prototype amp, sitting there right behind you? I, I honestly couldn't. It's like you've got the Midas Sh touch. Show them the back of the guitar. Look at that color. See, see, it's not bad. I mean, it, so, so I hijacked the interview. <laughs> I hijacked the interview. I don't think I've ever said less in an interview, it's ever. It's good. By the way, I've got my my uh, artists watching your uh, videos. Be just because it was made in England, it doesn't matter anymore because it's the internet. Nobody, it's like nobody. It doesn't matter anymore. It's taken all the borders away. You've really done something. All your videos are international now. If, uh, so is this payment from me to you for all the marketing you've done for my company? <laughs> You know the crazy thing is, and we. And by the way, that's not where it came from. It came from just wanting to thank you for all your hard work. And do you know that the, 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 I, mean, I am so. You, I know you, you the, don't have any Mark, words. I, have, I honestly I haven't got, got any that's words. Great. I, the more we do these, success. the more we do these videos, and the more I get to work with um, friends of mine that we can introduce to the channel to be yeah. presenters and get to meet guys like you and become, you know, form lifetime friendships. The more I realize is it's really not marketing. It's just sharing 
the joy yeah. of playing nice guitars or, or any guitars just making music and breaking down barriers and doing something that's not about you know competitive well, you know why people like the videos because they're honest and yeah, they're, 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 they're just human because they? they're honest and they're human so are you guys going to film the press conference uh, when John's here and make it one of your videos because you got to put you it up physically could not keep me away if John Mayer's going to be here I'm going to be the screaming fan girl. No, you're at the not. Front. You are not going to do that. <laughs> listen, I will come in just in a look, pair of pants. Listen, John May, no, no, I no, love no, you. No, 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 Britain. no, 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 no. You're not going to do this. <laughs> you're going to hold your. You're going to hold your shit together. You're not going to do this. All right. You're, you're going to hold it together. Okay. No man crushes okay. in my booth. Okay. okay. If you if, if, just keep it to yourself, it'll be all right. But by the way. He's like you, very passionate, very intelligent, knows what he's doing, knows what he likes, and we got the nod to make the guitar for the Dead & Company tour. He needed a tool to do the job. And so here, this is part of the tools to do the job. Anyway, this is not about John. This is not about that amp. This is about this guitar, and I hope you, I hope it brings you a lifetime of pleasure. It's so now you have seven guitars, not six. It's already, like, uh, it's, it's, I don't know what to say, Paul. I just need to give you a big cuddle. That's, that's it, that's the end of the interview. It's just a massive thank you very much. All right, we're good. Thank you oh, very look, much. You know, now the excitement of just wanting to play it is kicked in, which is what really should always happen. Let's play happen. catch. You ready? No, no, no. There you, go. <laughs> you can tell somebody loves a guitar because they freak out when you yeah. play catch. <laughs> Okay, so just before we leave the beautiful PRS stand at NAMM 2017, um, and assuming you've just seen what's happened with the Paul Reed Smith interview, I'm still in shock. <laughs> we all are in um, shock a little bit, but that was. Uh, but yes, so we're lucky man. Anyway. <laughs> so, anyway, Sonzera amps. If you haven't seen these yet, these are some slightly more affordable amplifiers that Paul's designed. Um, so they're made uh, in the Far East, so that they're you know attainable kind of money for uh, your average gigging guitar player. So the twenty. I think is only available as a combo, a yeah. 112 combo. Yep. It's going to be 6.99. It's, it's affordable. Yeah, as far as I can understand. Two channels with a reverb. It's a 6L6 loaded power amp with a Celestian V-type 1x12 speaker in it. Um, I like it. It's I like this. What do you call it? It's like a salt and pepper grill. Yeah, it looks good, man. The logo it looks, looks smart. With the gold and the gold writing on it. Yeah, it's nice and compact, isn't it? Yeah. Um, what have we got on the back? Let's have a little lookey. Effects loop, foot switch options, various speaker outputs. Looks like it's got a pair of 6L6s in there. Beautiful. And you got the uh, 50? Yep. Uh, more knobs by the looks of things. So got a few more controls on... A reverb for each channel. Right. Which is a really cool feature. Yeah, that's handy. So you got reverb for each channel. So if you've got a drive channel, a clean channel and drive... I think more, more amps should do that. Because you want Absolutely. lots of reverb for clean and it's too washed, isn't it? If that you depends, don't. of course, how they set the reverb up, whether it's a, a spring reverb, then you have to have one for each channel, or it's a digital reverb. I actually don't know if it's it spring be. or digital in these. Um, um, but you know what I mean? I can imagine it might be a digital one if it's on... Otherwise, you'll have to have two trays, really, wouldn't you? So uh, no, you just, you just change the... You've just got a level control for each one. So let's have a little look, see if we can find... It's in very new, the but, but they come in a hat. Uh, and a, a combo as well down here. You take over, Pete. I'm yeah, just reading I'll stuff. Over. Nice little switches here. You got a normal and a bright switch on each channel as well. Uh, presence, an overall presence. It doesn't say. It doesn't say. So no. well, we'll leave that up to. Uh, uh, to I reckon it's spring there. reverb. It's yeah. big enough, isn't it? And this is available as a 50 watt head or a 50 watt combo. Yeah. Yeah. Let's test it for weight. Is it portable? <laughs> 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 oh, no. I mean, it's not it's not impossible to lift, but you know, it's 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 a real man's amp, yeah. as opposed to someone wimpy like me. Yeah. <laughs> um, so that's it. That's uh, if we have a quick pan round here uh, of a bunch of the guitars that we didn't do close-ups on, but that's because it's all the SE range, uh, and there are no new models in the SE range. Uh, so there we go. Anyway. That's it, right? I guess. Yeah. We should move on. And remember to, if you want to keep up to date with us here on the NAM show, you go on Anderson's.co.uk slash NAM. Do you want to, you do you want to see a photograph of me wearing an Anderson's t-shirt going like this? Do you want to see that? Yeah. Okay, run it. I'd rather be... No, I would, eh? This is the only place I want to be. Check it out. Sexy. <laughs>